We are back at it again here with another video with the invest for tomorrow to the first time viewers and investors. Welcome to the channel to all subscribers. Welcome back. Here we are at MU Online Stock, Mullen Automotive Inc. Continuing to break out to newer highs here and testing key resistance levels. And it wasn't the only stock experiencing volatility. The overall market and the SPY did as well. And our SPY buy sent out a bear indicator at 9.50 a.m. And from that moment forward, outflows crossed the midpoint to the downside. Pure weakness there on 42 vision and put options went up 200 percent plus within an hour guys if you guys want to receive this clarity and edge of the charts you can now gain access to it as well the link is down below in the description to the 42 vision indicators getting connected over to our bots and becoming part of a growing community of investors all looking to learn and grow together by receiving this clarity and edge over the charts and using these resources to maximize in either direction whether stocks are going up or going down so here we are with MUO line stock Molin automotive in continuing to retest key resistance levels and we're going to talk about the key levels i would watch going into tomorrow and what's going on with the inflow versus outflow and bull and bear indicators but before we do i want to share with you guys the home opportunity that was mentioned this morning over at the discord so the home run of the day was spectacular and beyond expectations. And if you guys want to know about these stocks early on and receive this clarity and edge of the charts, you can now gain access to it as well. The link is down below in the description to the 42 vision indicators, getting connected over to our bots and becoming part of a growing community of investors, all looking to learn and grow together. And the home run of the day was from our Netflix bot. Our Netflix bot sent out a bull indicator at 9.30 a.m. And from that moment forward, inflows cross the midpoint to the upside full strength there on 42 vision and call options went up 150 percent plus within an hour guys and as you see it popping up there within the screen within the options chain some options even went higher than that if you guys want to receive this clarity and edge over the charts you can now gain access to it as well the link is down below in the description to the 42 vision indicators getting connected over to our bots and becoming part of a growing community of investors all looking to learn and grow together we look forward to having you join us and we strive for opportunities like these every single day let's jump into these charts so here we are at femio line stock Mullen automotive in doing a full transition from the dip area to the rip area in today's pre-market and continuing to hit multiple rip areas here on 42 vision in today's volatility and if this is your first time coming across the channel this is 42 vision which allows us to see the dips from the rips the rips to the dips and where the strength and weakness lies within the charts and we also use our bull and bear indicators and inflow versus outflow as an extra layer of confirmation which i'm going to pull up here and you can now gain access to as well the link is down below in the description to the 42 vision indicator getting connected over to our bots and becoming part of a growing community of investors all looking to learn and grow together by receiving this clarity and edge over the charts and using these resources to maximize in either direction whether stocks are going up or going down and in today's video i'm going to pull up the inflow versus outflow indicator which adds that extra layer of confirmation and gives us that edge within the volatility so here we are with femio line stock Mullen automotive inc under a bull indicator after having a volatile start to the day it had a bear indicator here at 12 cents went all the way down to the 11 cent area got a bull indicator here at 12 30 area and hit high so far of nearly 1350 and doing a full transition here in this volatility from the dip area to the rip area now as i've stated in previous videos the inflow versus outflows will be crucial and critical to justify any further strength to the upside these inflows need to start picking up heading towards the midpoint and possibly even crossing over it to go ahead and justify the possible strength that can continue to reflect into these charts now if we zoom in and look at this from the 15 minute in the volatility we could go ahead and see here how the inflow versus outflows have crossed over and now quickly here in the second half of the day it is right there near the midpoint slightly below it guys something to not ignore here and under a bull indicator 
since down here at 1230 area and a staircase effect forming here and to continue the bulls need to bring these inflows back up on the 15 minute try to reflect that strength over into the 30 minute and retest key resistance levels and hold this bull indicator true and not get canceled by a bear indicator now when we zoom out and look at it from the one hour we can go ahead and see here in the bigger picture it's under a bull indicator since this pre-market at 1230 area outflows are dominating but they're really close to the midpoint here when you zoom out not that far from it but something to not ignore here is the fact that a bull indicator popped up today and a full transition has happened so far from the dip area to the rip area here in the bigger picture as well and a staircase effect is forming and to continue it needs to retest the recent highs right so what are the key levels i would watch well the first thing is support guys and the first support level is 12 cents then below that i'll be watching the 10 cent area and then the 8 cent area if these outflows continue to the downside reflecting that weakness into these charts and canceling out this bull indicator with a possible bear indicator as well as on the 15 minute and one hour right now to the upside it's going to be crucial and critical as i stated earlier in the video to continue this staircase effect get these inflows back up and cross over on the 15 minute back above the midpoint continue to hold true this bull indicator on the 15 minute and on the 30 minute as well as on the one hour and try to retest the highs of day at 1360 area where things rejected back here on thursday of last week very crucial level to not ignore and then above that comes the 14 cent area and then i'll be watching the 15 to 17 cent area so those are the key levels i'll be watching to the upside and to the downside the bull and bear indicators are going to be crucial and critical as well as the inflow versus outflows i would not ignore them and on the 15 minute it is really close to the midpoint and that is something i'll be watching closely going into tomorrow as always guys thank you guys so much for watching and let's make some money so if you made it this far into the video and you are a swing trader or looking to gain an edge when it comes to swing trading you're definitely going to want to check this out and this is our new swing bot that will be fully released really soon and so far it has sent two notifications in the last several days right the first one as you see it poppy up there was nvidia on friday of last week at around 444 dollars and the other one was tesla yesterday in the pre-market and from yesterday to today and even yesterday alone it ran up nearly ten dollars plus now when it comes to the nvidia one you could see it poppy up there on the screen i shared the chart yesterday and i also circled an area as you see it there in the chart how it kept on bouncing off that support and trying to hold above 444 and then i put a line across when that notification came in and now you're seeing this other chart which i shared today in the pre-market and i stated right you could see the same line there and i put the swing by notification there at around the 444 area it was already opening up from yesterday to today at 449 and i talked about in that purple area the area that kept on acting like support and there was a strong resistance in the pre-market and previous days at the 452 area and the bulls would need to break through that for possible continuation not guaranteed but it was important and inflows needed across now when you see it here in the next chart going into the open it was broken through bull indicator popped up and then inflows crossed over and you could see the purple area that continued to act like support and the video calls were up nearly a hundred percent plus with the swing notification bot since it was sent out right and you could see that blue line again where that notification was sent at that after hours on friday so this is our new swing bot if you take a look at tesla 2 it sent it out at around the 256 dollar area and tesla went to highs here of nearly 270 dollars in the last two days and it was sent out yesterday in the pre-market right right around this area and the full move so typically with these swing bots and the notifications that come in they're there to add perspective nothing's guaranteed but the goal is for it to add perspective take a look look for possible support levels 
and bullish confirmations of a reversal. And from there, it typically pans out within several days to weeks. But sometimes it can happen this fast within one or two days. And when it does, I typically tend to make a rational decision because maybe my goals and strategy and expectations have been met, right? I don't want to get too greedy either, but I wanted to share with you guys our new swing bot that's going to be notifying directly into our Discord on high probability opportunities based off specific criterias and dip areas of why we're Fred Borders, as I call them, on multiple time frames and other criterias to confirm of the possibility of it looking like a possible support or area to not ignore for a possible swing of a reversal. As always, guys, thank you guys so much for watching, and let's make some money.